and now we insert a new brand but before before display all available brands in the, our database i want to change something i want to change the, the alert by default when we add a new brand let me add a new brand let's say that we want to add toyota when we click on save we have this alert which appear and i don't want to use this alert i want to use sweet alert too so we will add sweet alert to to our project for add it you need to go to sweet alert to website you type it on google and you click on the first link when you are on this page you need to click on install after installation, you need to copy the script, all of the script bar, and go to pass it in our project. So let's come back to the project and open the folder in the include folder of the admin and go bottom. And after jQuery, you need to add a suite alert to CDN. Okay. When added, you need to come back to Suite Palette 2 and button you will see something where we call it usage and fall go button and take all of this because we want to use this one and come to our project. Let's say that we will call the Suite Palette 2 when the data when the data and set it successfully so it's here when we are check if the data is a success so instead of alert let's delete alert instead of alert we will pass all of this and let's say that the title will be success and the text will be will be the success message let's say for the icon we don't want the error icon we want the success icon and here for the confirm button action is it will be brand add close now okay so we will use the same thing for the error if we have some error we leave the title as your and let's see that the test will be but uh, and here is your message and the icon will be your and the confirm button will be let's say your and now save this and come back to our app refresh and let's add a new brand let's say that we want to add Dacia and click on save rent why we have this error and now click on add new brand let's add a new brand here it says that the success is true And the error is fault. We have some error on the manage brand backend. So let's come back to the manage backend. Here is not false, is not string, it's just false. Let's add a new brand and click save now. And here we have a success brand and set it successfully. So the bug was at the back end. We you need to go to the back end when you when you when where we manage branch and for this error it was in a single cut and it was considered as a string of is a boolean so you need to remove all of them and sweet alert will be added so now 